Ottawa County Commissioners also voted 8 to 2 tonight to approve a resolution to promote life. The document listed in the meeting packet reads in part, the board affirms the unalienable personhood rights of every American from the moment of conception until natural death. The resolution recognizes that the county's Department of Public Health does not provide abortions or transportation to abortion services, while also encouraging the community to promote life, support women making a choice for life, and protect the pre-born. During public comment, we heard from people for and against the resolution. We also heard from a woman speaking on behalf of a group of Ottawa County employees. She said they are concerned about how this resolution may impact health care benefits. County Chairperson Joe Moss addressed these concerns before the vote. Your employees are scared right now. The resolution to promote life as it is currently worded could hold repercussions for employee benefits specifically for the health care coverage of miscarriage care and emergency DNCs. I ask you to imagine being a county employee who is pregnant and experiences a miscarriage. Now imagine being informed that the medication and or medical procedure required in getting miscarriage care is not covered by your employer insurance. Um, this resolution does not impact employee health care. Uh, I think it's also important to clarify uh, miscarriage care and ectopic pregnancy care is not abortion. Um, we care for all of our constituents and a culture of life with compassionate care for mothers and families. And we need to do everything in our power to make sure that women faced with difficult circumstances are supported. And that means supporting policies that provide the best prenatal care and supports and more. She went on to propose several amendments, the employee who you heard from, specifically one clarifying that the resolution would not change employee health care benefits. The amendments were not adopted.